funny seeing you, you know, in all your period get up and all that sort of stuff. Are. And, and then, then suddenly modern. I thought yeah. I was going to get a boo then. I was thinking, oh, <laughs> <laughs> no. no. <laughs> What's it been like from people in the street? You know, have you had that sort of reaction? Well, I keep on the little intro that you had earlier, it said, and the, the Mr. Selfridge's villain. Yeah, yeah. villain. Yeah. I'm so not a villain, not in my mind anyway. Well, I'm, I think but... you are. <laughs> <laughs> no, sorry, does she I, really love him? Does she not? Yes, yeah. she does. No, but I just don't trust her at all. <laughs> She's been saying that all morning. I know I, I don't trust, trust her. her. There you are. We're both the same. We, we both hate you. <laughs> <laughs> you. Personally, I sit there and you're me on the too. screen and I think you're making me feel sorry for Mr. Selfridge. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Good that it's working. <laughs> what is that creepy brother you've got back in yes. that room? <laughs> What is that Everybody's about? like, who is that? Is that her brother or her lover or what is yeah, that? Exactly. Who is that? No, was, you're supposed to not know for a little while. And then, oh, really? Yeah. There. But I think he makes her, because he's mean to her and holds him, hold her under his thumb, right. it makes you sort of feel sorry for her a little and bit And what more. about no? your engagement? Are you going to tell the rest of the family? Well, she's trying to, as we just saw in that clip, trying to keep it secret for a little while, because, I mean, she, she does really want to marry him. And I think it's she kind of gets lost in her own con. Basically, oh. she starts to mean it. Um, right. She didn't at the beginning. Yes, she was an evil person at the beginning. Yeah. But as it goes on, the story, she gets lost in her own story and thinks, actually, why can't I just be this person? I've told everybody I am. Oh. So yes, maybe yeah. I can brother, actually because just because your brother won't like it. That's but then why. if we sort of start lying to him and make him be, and then sort of yeah. go along with being, can actually, I why can't I be Can I ask you Mr. about Selfridge? your qualifications? Your building, <laughs> Harry, your building, Mr. Selfridge's giant <laughs> estate. Yes, that's true. What are your qualifications? <laughs> <laughs> Are you an architect, a plumber, or what? Are you Just hoping plumber? nobody asks me anything. Like, <laughs> no, there was a bit in one of the episodes earlier on where, because I was thinking, yeah, she doesn't. Yeah. People would see straight through immediately. But yes. she's, there's a thing where she's been grafting. She's been up all night trying to so that anything that anyone asks her, she, she comes in with a roll of plans. <laughs> <gasps> those plans. I think I held those plans in about every single scene. I was in. <laughs> if I talk about these cottages again, six months of filming and me with like these plans of cottages. Can I, I ask you, um, yeah. where, artistic license wise? Mm -hmm. Now um, I'm assuming. I'm assuming this isn't the real, she isn't part of that real story. No, she didn't exist in real life, I so she's a fictional she character. Yeah. But then this, what happens at the end of this series goes on to the fourth the series, series yes, yeah. of what actually happened to The Harry. demise of him. Yes, yeah. exactly. Because the story of Mr. Selfridge is tragic. Oh, it's yeah. terrible. Yeah, so it I is, think The he... next series is, yeah. 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 <laughs> <laughs> but they will be, won't it, because it's so sad what happens. Yeah. So we better not say what happens. But it's history. Uh, you should they're, just, they're just slightly obsessed with the series. I the first series, so, uh, so I've got the box set waiting and I'm planning a big box of chocolates and to watch the whole thing through. So I'm well, gonna, a wife So her. I'm going to ask her back... Yeah, well, don't spoil everything for <laughs> me. So I want to ask you something back. Say, so first of all, I'm fascinated that you've been trying to get a part for a, a while, and we actually yeah. had Cara Toynton on here. Yeah. You to get, and you were originally up for that part. For that part. So this is the third series. I auditioned for the first series when it was brand new. Didn't mm. get in. Second series, I can't even remember what the part was. This third series, I auditioned for Cara's role, which I'm totally wrong for, being 35. Uh -huh. Don't think mm. I'm closed daughter, Did you really. say that when you went in? I <laughs> sort of, I, I read it and then sort of there was a big silence. I went, I don't think I'm right for this part. And I went, you're so not right for this part. <laughs> <laughs> so then did you suggest? Well, yeah. as, well, as I've been reading it, I went, who's Nancy? Who's this character of Nancy? And they said, well, we don't really know. We haven't really written it yet. We know who she is and what happens with her, but we're not sure. I said, well, who have you offered it to? Thinking they'll just offer it to somebody famous. Because well, they'll just cheeky, do... Well, you've got to get in I there. love that. I love well, that. I said, well, who have you offered it yeah. to? Because I knew it'd be a straight offer to somebody famous. And they said, uh, well, we haven't yet. And I said, well, can I just come back and read for that? Part oh, then. Good for you. And they were like, yeah, okay. And so as they were writing it as I went along, 